Building an online community is the new flex here in 2024. I don't know if you heard or seen all across social media about a platform called School. Now, Alex Harmozy has been really endorsing this platform. It's becoming more and more popular. A lot of entrepreneurs, solopreneurs, and marketers are on this type of, of community platform. It has an app and everything. I'm even a member of some of the groups and communities on this platform. So that's why I'm able to speak to it. I do like the interface. I do like the app. Everything looks pretty good. It was created a couple of years ago by Sam Ovens. He's a goat in the marketing space. So he kind of took his knowledge and what he knows. And he's really a, a, vision, a visionary because everything now with so much information being out, everything is flocking. Everybody is flocking to communities because they want to be around people that they know, like, and trust. Okay. We've heard that over and over again, know, like, and trust. And to be honest with you, being a part of these communities is, has made me want to do one of my own. Now, if you're new to the channel, welcome. My name is Dee Willis. I'm a digital product creator and coach, and I also create information products. So that's pretty much what I do. I'm all about that digital life, and we are stepping into the digital renaissance era, if you haven't already realized that, with the rise of AI. But anyway, my YouTube family, I missed you. I missed you. I know it's been a while since I made a video, and that's because I told you previously that it was going to be some changes for 2024. And I want to let you know some of the things I didn't abandon you. I didn't leave you. I'm still here. And if you left comments on any of my videos, I was responding. I was still in the comment section. I just wasn't recording. And the reason why is because I got a coach this year. So I really, really invested. And I see now why they tell people to get coaches. Now, it's one thing for them to tell you to get a coach and you be like, okay, I, I'll take a course and then you're communicating with that person and that person is kind of working as your coach. It's a difference when you spend thousands, a few thousands, because now it puts another type of hustle in you. It puts, puts another level of pressure on you to where when you pay for a $297 course or something like that, or you're doing something monthly, a monthly membership, 37, 47, something like that. That's money that you don't mind losing. People spend, lose more than that at the casino. Okay. People spend more than that on a wig from IC hair, right? Or an outfit and some shoes to go out. They didn't spend about $300 just for that, for the whole outfit and the shoes. So when people can spend that kind of money, regular money that to them, when it's regular, on something, it's not like you're going outside of your comfort zone. But when you really go outside your comfort zone, it make it puts a stretch on you where you know uh, failure ain't an option, right? So I've been working on that, and by me working on that, um, I did get some new equipment, new camera. Shout out to my niece informing me about this place called a TikTok shop. Yeah, your girl didn't know TikTok had a shop. I knew TikTok, but I didn't know it had a shop. So I got this new 4K Ultra HD camera. I love the fact that I have a wide lens. I'm looking, I can kind of see my reflection. It is working a little bit better. I like, I still like my webcam. I just feel like I like the, the aesthetic of the webcam better. I think, I don't know. I'll get used to this, right? So this is the first video I'm shooting with it. Of course, you might see some lights because I didn't got some lights. So I'm trying to upgrade just a little bit. I'm not about to turn into somebody I'm not. I'm not one of them bougie, fancy people. Um, what you see is what you get. And that's just how I roll. But I also wrote a book. Now this, and I've wrote, I've done over 50 plus um, information products. Okay, so that's neither here nor there. But the book I wrote, is for legacy. And that's for like my grandkids. And, and so that way I can have a piece of me. I would have loved to, for my Nana and my ancestor has to have left something behind. I wish they had the technology we have today and the capabilities that we do have today and opportunity that we have today. I wish they had it in their day. Cause maybe that would help a lot of us where if we can just open up something and read and be a part of that instead of just hearing stories, you know, like dad, I wish I was around back then to see what they would say about this or what they think about this. Well, if, that's why I want to put all of that in the book. So that way my generations down the line, they can take, oh, this is how my, you know, my Nana thought or whatever. So they can get more intimate and get to know me on, you know, during the time I'm not around. So it's more so for legacy in that sense, but it is called Images in My Reflection. And it does talk about 
basically my life and the things I went through. I was a teen mom. So based on, based on society standards, I shouldn't be where I am today based on things that happened to me and where I've been. I'm surprised I am where I am today. So in and of itself, that is in the book. Also, um, digital products. Ooh, let's talk about these digital products. Your girl didn't got another Etsy store. Okay, so y'all know about the Design Diva. If you don't know, now you know. I have an Etsy shop, the Design Diva. That's what I kicked off my channel with. And of course, all everybody went to the Design Diva. Stats crazy, but I still got the Design Diva. All my templates and watercolor uh, clip art is over there, but I created a new one. I haven't opened it to the public yet because I'm waiting to get 10 listings, 10 big listings together because the type of clip art that's over there is more so 3D and it is fire. So no, I'm not going to release that chant that that's the shop, <laughs> but I will share with you certain things about the shop, but I'm just not going to give you the name of the shop anyway. So that's in the works as well. And I also recorded an on-demand workshop. Now I had a lot of people ask me, how am I able to crank out all of these information products and I'm able to do this. And that's because I can do it relatively quickly. I have a six step process that I do. I put it into a blueprint basically, and I recorded a workshop. Now the workshop is about an hour long and I mean, it's really jam packed with stuff, but it's not overwhelming. Okay, I made a workbook to it. It's called the one day book blueprint. It goes over the six steps. I actually show you stuff and that's kind of why it's an hour because it's not just me talking for an hour. It's me actually going into my computer and doing stuff. So you get to see that it has the workbook to it as well. And once individuals have watched the workshop, two more things come their way. And that is the five secrets to transforming your expertise into a best selling book and the self publishing success checklist. Now those come after the workshop because you don't need all of that information up front because it won't benefit you until after you receive the knowledge and, you know, took care of what you needed to take care of in the workbook. And then those things are for after the fact. So that's a great uh, tool. It's free. Okay. So let, let me just stop right there. It's free. I'm gonna have a link below. So if that's something that you want to learn, if that's a skill you want to learn, whether you want to learn that skill to be able to teach that skill to somebody else and charge for that, or take the skill and use it yourself. I've been doing it so much now, I can create multiple um, information products in, in a day, all right? So these are assets for you, digital assets that can generate passive income for you. So I uh, put that together. And this is kind of what I wanna center my group around. I wanna center my group, my Facebook group, free group, around um, digital product creation and information product creation to so other people can learn the skills that they want to learn in this digital realm to be able to make digital products like planners, templates, clip arts, things like that, information products, things that they can utilize. And information products is is a lot, right? And let's just let me just be let me just be frank. Um, information products in and of itself are basically any product that's teaching somebody something. So you can do an information product in a book, which is self-publishing at the end of the day, in a course, in a membership in a coaching program, all of this stuff is information because you're sharing information with someone else to teach them that information. So there's all considered information products. Uh, information product could be a course itself teaching somebody how to do clip art. So they learning, you got two things going on. You got the clip art and information products. So it's just, I want to combine those two because they're so closely related because what you learn, you can put into uh, information product. You can put it in there. And then that way, this is the only business model that I know of. And I've been in business for almost two decades as an entrepreneur doing online and brick and mortar. But this is the only business model that I know of that you can actually build a business of one, be successful here in the digital renaissance. And it also gives you all four freedoms. You get the creative freedom because now you don't have to meet nobody's standards, but your own. You also have the time freedom because once you create it, you don't have to trade your hours for dollars. Once you create it once, you can get paid on it over and over and over again. So that's a, a freedom. Then you have location freedom because you can do this anywhere in the world as long as you got internet connection. Okay, so you're not stuck in one place. And it has all of these things have the possibility of creating uh, financial freedom because it's all passive income for you. It's just how big or how much you want to build that portfolio up for yourself. Okay. And this is kind of what I want to build the community around. And, and I'm telling you, 
community is the thing. If you notice, everybody's building communities. Just think about it. Alex Harmozy is, uh, is talking about it. I mean, big people is talking about because if, if people want to be around people, they want to be around people they can trust. They want to be around ethical people. They want to be, you know, embraced and supported and inspired and encouraged. And a lot of times you don't get that in your normal surrounding because I guarantee you, you're probably your family or wherever you are or live, you probably like the only one in your clique, right? That do the things you do, right? Especially if you were online and it, it feel good to get around a community of other people. And I wasn't a community person at first, but I'm telling you the, the way this community is or the way I've been in some of these other communities, I'm like, Ooh, this is good because uh, and then I see things not to do. I see what's in communities and I'm like, this community suck, right? Like, or this person trying to be somebody they not. And I can read people very well and I, and I don't, and I can tell. So I like genuine people. I like people that's down to earth, real, not stuck up. So if you bougie and all extra stuck up, don't join my group because <laughs> I'm not trying to be mean. I'm just down to earth and I don't do, I'm not, I'm not formal. I'm not going to do for That's not me, but, um, stay tuned to the channel. I am back. So I'm going to be releasing videos at least once every week, but in the group, I'm going to try to go live and I'm only going to announce that to my email list. So if you're not on the list, sign up for the workshop below in the, in the link in the description. And then that way you can get on the list and then that way you can be notified. So that way you can get on my email list because I'm going to shoot it over there first. Cause I want a couple of people in there first. You don't want just one person in the group. You want to like at least a good five or six people first. Okay. And then that way we can do some things and then hopefully we can grow it. Right. And people can be the founding members type of situation. So again, um, I look forward to speaking with you next week as always love you. And until the next video, bye.